refrigerator refrigerator complaint is water on floor first observation water trails or evidence of water trails coming from door gasket gives me an indication of environmental controls water is getting in this area freezing and then pouring onto flooring door sill looks compromised no evidence of water trail coming down the center and it's not hot meaning the external fan is good and the ice supply is on the left side no evidence of any water melting from the ice bucket that could possibly drain down the door crease freezer side looks good no evidence of any environmental control abnormalities airflow looks good no airflow blockage from the freezer to the refrigerator. Return side air duct is open. Water filter line, insulation is good. No trace evidence of, of water, icing. No, no trace evidence on door.
water only appears to be in the first two levels of the door drawer. More than a cup amount. Water is entering into the door gasket seal. Still haven't found the source of where this water is accumulating from. So gravity is what's, on, is what's pushing it down into the bottom seal. Locating the source of where this water is coming from. And this is the fresh food site. And so fresh food site does not have the water line in the door. Uh, the water line is accessible in the rear for the water filter uh, back here only. And so that would not be a good source of where uh, this water is coming from. And there's no water connector joints and the door hinges that will give a trail run down the seam here. The only logical thing that I can think of is environmental. Uh, the environmental temperature is getting cold enough where it's creating um, ice crystals when the door is open and closed often enough a uh, refrigerator in design is just a heat exchange uh, and so as the heat comes in the compressors turned on and will remain on for a durational runtime of 
uh, 22 hours. Uh, within, the, within that run time, uh, the thermostat is what will turn the compressor on and off once temperature is met. If the thermostat is not turning the compressor thermostat, um, if it's not turning the compressor off, then the only thing I can deduct here is that when the door is open often enough and heat is being converted into cold, uh, crystals are formed and collecting and freezing and thawing and then dripping. And so the door seal is not damaged. I don't see where air could be entering into the refrigerator other than these edges here. And so the only thing that can be done at this time, since a water source cannot be identified, is to clean the seal, remove and dry the water, clean the seal, and monitor um, the next time there is a water spillage or water leak or breach onto the floor. Uh, then maybe at that time uh, replace the door seal gasket to help prevent ambient air as I feel is a contributor uh, to prevent ambient air from entering into the refrigerator. There is a pin prick hole right there in which the water can enter inside of the uh, seal. So it may be warranted to replace the door seal gasket.
water cannot penetrate this door sill gasket. Conclusion of repair, door seal gasket was allowing water into molding, put a seal coat on molding, maintenance and service, refrigerator should test good. Door seals cleaned and maintenanced.